12-week visit. Yay, you've graduated. Um, you've waited your three-month period of time, which seems like forever, and now it's time to go to the next step, which is for me to process all your paperwork and, or my staff, I should say, and send it to the insurance company and wait to see if they will authorize our treatments. Now, I've done this for a long time as has my staff. So we're very good at compiling your information and sending the information, I guess, and um, explaining it well enough that we have almost 100% authorization rate. Now, that may sound like no big deal to you, but all of this doesn't matter if we can't get insurance to pay. So that's key. Now, the 12-week visit, um, the first part is, again, for us to document how you are doing. So if you come in and you say to me, Jane, I'm doing great. My legs feel great. I've worn my hose. They don't bother me. I don't need my Advil. I do elevate at night. I'm exercising. I've lost weight. Awesome. Now, the truth of the matter is most people don't say that. And again, um, I'm sticking my neck out, but my opinion is that wearing hose, etc., is like putting duct tape on a broken pipe. If you have pipes that aren't working, we know they're not going to normalize. And if there's something I can do to fix it, why not do it? And the earlier we catch it, the better. Now again, what I'm saying is very controversial. Um, don't tell your friends, although as I said, we're going to be putting this on the web, so I'll probably get in trouble. But I'm always going to do what's right for you. And, so, and I'll always be honest, because if I'm not, you won't trust me. Okay, so the 12 week visit, you come in, we do the same thing we did at the six week. How are you doing? How are your symptoms? Um, we take a look at your exam and we document that. By and large, people say, you know, I'm really not better. And we document that. Then we package up everything. Now, you've done a lot of work already. You're already sick of us. You've come for the consultation. You've had the ultrasound. Um, maybe your six week visit was combined with the ultrasound. Now it's 12 weeks. You've come here three or four times, and we haven't even started treatment. Now, I always say my vision is to have you walk in here, do the consultation, walk you up into the ultrasound room, do the ultrasound, and treat you. Because almost all our treatments take about 20 to 30 minutes, and you can walk right out of here. Now, I would love to do that. And to a great extent, I used to do that before insurance paid because when it was fee-for-service, I could do veins, treat veins the way I knew was, in my opinion, the best and the quickest. But this is really insurance-driven, so don't get mad at us. Get mad at your insurance company. So the 12-week visit, I just told you, you know, document how you're doing. Now, what people love at this visit is we finally tell you about treatment. Now, we have to be a little cautious as to what we tell you, because I may outline a plan and your insurance may come back and say no. And I may say, well, gee, Blue Cross said they would do this last month and now it's different. And believe me, this happens all the time. So when I propose your treatment plan, you have to understand that this may change. So we do the best we can. Now, we send your paperwork off to some fax number and various people look it over and with any luck we get a fax back that tells us you're authorized and um, what procedures they will allow us to do. Then we can tell you this is what, how we're going to proceed. Now, typically there are two options in terms of treatment and I'm going to start at the top. Now, I've got to warn you that this is where my lack of artistic skill really gets me because it's hard to explain this. But here's your leg, okay, here's your knee, here's your groin. Now, as I've told you, the veins that we're treating, the blood is going this way. So the source of the problem is here. So just as if you had a leaky hose, you've got to turn it off 
at the source. You've got to turn off the faucet. It's the same thing with treating the veins. Now, there are a couple of steps. There's a couple of um, processes that we go through to treat your veins. And basically, I like to break them down into three steps, okay? Now, the first one is a laser. 